So in real terms, the, the hotel brand is over 100 years old. But in practical terms, we see ourselves as very young. Jeddah was a great place to launch the brand outside the US for the first time. And if you look at our subsequent openings in Dubai and Ras Al Khaimah, it's a great story in the region. We have a long history with the Middle Eastern travel. I mean, obviously starting with Manhattan. We understand them. We understand their high expectations. We understand their travel dynamic. So we understand how to accommodate families in particular, you know, that their needs, their sense of pre-arrival requests, how we cater for them. We have a great growth story in the region. We're really looking forward to welcoming Water Story Kuwait, Water Story Riyadh, and obviously the soon to open Water Story DIFC. 275 rooms, 46 really well-appointed suites, and a residential component that really does provide a great mix for that development. One of the prime drivers to visit a luxury hotel is the cuisine on offer. We have a whole team dedicated to looking at what we think is the best offer for the hotel, and our, and our sole ambition is to provide best-in-class cuisine. We've got a number of relationships with high-profile chefs. You know, that's reflected with Heinz Beck at La Pergola at the Rome Cavalieri with Three Michelin. We've got Sydney and Sasha at Spectrum at the Waldorf Story Amsterdam. And even Heinz Beck has a restaurant here at the Waldorf Story at Dubai Palm. We focus our entire brand around three pillars. True world of service being the first, because I think that's how you define yourself. I mean, amongst everything else, service has to be key. Second one is authentic moments, and I think that really relates to you know, our approach to cuisine and our approach to you know, creating memories that last a lifetime. And the last one is inspirational environments. I mean, I think if, if you walk into a world of Astoria and your first sentiment isn't your sense of place, I think then we failed. I think for me, when you walk into Waldorf, your sense of arrival, you want to know you're in the Middle East, you want to know you're in Dubai, you want to know you're in Saudi. I think that second emotion should be, I'm in a Waldorf Astoria. And if we get that balance right, I think we'll succeed.